How's everyone? This is KJ Story. I'm doing, I hope you're all doing well and keeping safe. I'm doing my favourite witch's box today, which is the Earth Re Alchemy Witch's Chest. Um, it is a beautiful autumn day, but as I have been sitting out here, it's starting to get a little bit overcast. But um, hoping that this will be uh, clear enough for you to see. So this box is from, I can't quite remember, oh yeah, the protection magic so I'm hoping you can read that here we go and um, just a quick read for you if you want to pause and have a, a quick squeeze so sorry that I've been uh, taken so long to do this I've just had so many uh, things that I've had to tend to of late I'm not going to show you all the whoop whoops I'm going to go straight into the item so that there is all surprises so the first item that I am going to come across is a beautiful homemade pouch for the apothecary pouch and it is mugwort now mugwort of course is a beautiful witch's herb and I am going to love that smell earthy all the things you would expect of mugwort my camera just fell so sorry about that I'll get back to it I won't go into uh, each item in in detail because I will just um, let you read most of it at the end but um, I will ma maybe give you a little quick description uh, outline description uh, there's another little bubble wrap goodie um, Always my favourite oils, oils, and more oils, and it is a beautiful ritual oil. And again, sorry, it is a little bit iffy with the weather gone and changed on me, um, but I just don't have the time to reset up. I'm so sorry, but there it is. And the items in it is a fractionated coconut hang on let's have a look and see if you can see it there here we go so we have fractionated coconut oil dried rosemary there is lavender there is sandalwood there's cedarwood and beautiful frankincense so that is gonna I know already smell absolutely divine thank you come across another item which is some beautiful crystals they look like hematite actually and uh, can never have enough of these honestly can never have enough of these to work with so they're um, they come across as a, as almost like a mercury silver and there's two beautiful ones there so and then of course this beautiful little reusable baggie there is also oh, there's so many noodles here we go <laughs> noodles noodles and more noodles um, a beautiful oh this is oh look can you see that a little hint of it another handmade pendant which is so beautiful I love the colors can you see that up there Stunning, absolutely stunning. I'm going to show you that on the back they also have. Here we go. And this is um, with a, a necklace. Um, it, this, oh, this is really gorgeous. The closer I look, the more I see in there. I'm going to give you the description later but gorgeous I will be using that you can always place them on your altar work and work with them in rituals <gasps> guys look at this oh I love that and you know what that wood smells delicious that is beautiful I love the red color of the wood and um, again I'm sure that is all 
handmade. I'm going to pop that over there. There's a little the cards that they provide. I absolutely love these little cards. They're so handy to use when you want to just have a quick reference as well as the the larger ones for your <clears throat> book of shadows or your grimoire and what I intend to do with these is put them onto a ring um, and have them sort of all together on a ring so that I can just flip through them at any time and maybe hang them off a chain or something to that effect um, yeah love that So those are the main items. There's also always a gorgeous little thank you card from Earthly Alchemy. So cute. All right, I'm going to also go through a book of shadows. And there's the mugwort. Might take it out of the plastic just to give you a better look at that and then of course it has all the correspondences there and the associations for you on there and at the back again all the magical properties that attach to that and you can write your little notes love that artwork we also have and this is obviously a the part of this ritual box and it's for the protection spell look how gorgeous that is I'll read it to you. It says, by earth, sorry, by earth, by air, by fire, by water, bless the spell by each quarter. Ward me now with mystic light, banish darkness, evil and strife. Shield me now from jealousy, baneful magic or toxicity. Spiritual guardians, hear my plea. Grant me protection, so mode it be. And there is a very similar little artwork of the amulet pendant whichever you want to use it for we have the uh, earthly alchemy newsletter which I always read afterwards with a cup of tea and then we have the information sheet which I showed you earlier on for that um, here we have the mystic eye protection amulet and I'll give you a little quickie actually you should be able to read that but the eye of protection amulet has several symbols embedded within it so there is all the information if you'd like to pause and have a quick read then we have the protection spell book of shadows page and uh, the beautiful engraved disc so I just want to have a read of what that says. So this month we have a power engraved and stained this rustic pentacle disc. This disc is crafted from firwood for great for great for, sorry firwood great for protection and healing. So that's what I wanted to have a look at. It's firwood. That's why it's so beautiful. That red is stunning. So have a little uh, a read of that if you want to pause that as well. Then we have the witch's protection aura and all the information in there for you. So yes, it is a hematite crystals. Um, and hematite crystals, there we go, there's some information. Whoopsie, where are we? We're down here somewhere. That should, there we go. Um, you can read there. This month we have hand-selected hematite for your collection. Hematite crystals, crystal is a great stone to carry when needing some protection. So. As I said, you can never have enough of those. We then have the Mugwort Collectible Apothecary Pouch, the Mugwort Mint Apothecary Card. Just read that from here. And then the Mugwort Book of Shadows. So guys, I'm really happy with this box. I hope you are. I'm sorry it's such a short and quickie, but it gives you a little idea of what's in this month's box and um, I'm really excited to uh, go through it properly afterwards with, and read my uh, newsletter with a cup of tea. So um, as I said, please guys stay safe, take care and um, chat to you later.